Hi, I'm Sarah Walker and welcome to 96 Dreams. Ninety Six Dreams is a video blog of my journey from now and through to Rio 2016. So I went into World Champs having only ridden for one week. I had a broken arm, I broke it exactly five weeks to the day before Worlds and I wasn't sure how I was going to go, my aim was just to be there on the starting line racing for my country in New Zealand and yeah I was really excited. You can't argue with a broken arm finishing sixth in the world uh, for time trials so yeah, I went through the race day, had to raise the expectations a little bit and um, halfway through practice I managed to fall off into the first corner. Protected my arm so I wouldn't re-break it but managed to shoulder barge the concrete and yeah, hurt myself pretty bad so put some anaesthetic in my shoulder and rolled off the gate which was probably one of the coolest things but the hardest things I've ever had to do was roll around those three laps but the crowd went wild and was so supportive yeah, it was a very special moment. So after Worlds, I took a few riders on walker tours, which is basically a tour of a few of the best places in the North Island. They've never been to New Zealand before, and I just wanted to show them what the country had to offer. Uh, we went skydiving, bungee jumping, caving, rolling down the hill in massive falls. <laughs> uh, we went jet boating, did a whole bunch of cool stuff. I don't think you could beat jumping out of the plane with someone attached to you. It was probably the coolest part. But never ever thought that I would bungee jump because the ground is far too close. And to me, I think you just jump into your death. So yeah, I didn't really see myself ever doing it, but managed to convince myself to do it. And it was probably one of the stupidest things I've ever done. <laughs> but I had a blast and I, I'm not sure I'll do it again. Was in pretty good company, all really good friends, and uh, it was great to show them around. So after a week off my bike, I really wanted to get back on and start riding again. Just did some shoulder rehab, making sure that my shoulder could handle everything. I started riding and just wanted to have lots of fun. And so while I was um, had my time off, I started web new videos and. Uh, basically just started teaching myself to go further and further sideways. Beach party let us all kinda excited. Upper class but only no freshman invited. So it's not a new kid, smash on the agenda. Trying to have a week in your boy can't remember. Try the sky day, so you know I'm getting Training's going really well leading into Chula Vista coming up and I'm feeling really good on my bike. Just a few more things to put together for uh, in the gym and on the on the bike and sprints, but yeah, I feel feeling really comfortable. So I think that's really important heading to a big track like Chula. Hopefully try a few whips over the first straight and see straight over there. Keep an eye out for the next episode of 96 Dreams where I'll take you on my trip to Vietnam with variety. I look good. So, it's like, yeah.
it was moved. Good dog. <laughs> it's a loud plane. <laughs> Kit James, stop <laughs> flying planes over the track. If you're gonna fly planes over the track, Kit James, at least get some footage. So I had a week off out of her. So my riding is going really well, leading into, what was that? He's a monster. <laughs> <laughs> Woo!